Um, well, for starters, just as I didn't, I wasn't aware that this happened with Rihanna and stuff, I don't really keep track of those people, but, uh, it is pretty big, depending on who you are to talk about that. I, people are going to have different opinions on if it hurts them or not, but yeah, if you're getting abused, it's, it's hard for you, and I don't, I don't want to say that she shouldn't have done that, but... I don't know how to describe it. I guess just with me, like, I wouldn't have a problem talking about it because I'm a very honest person, but I don't, I don't know. I just don't think that, I don't think it should be an embarrassment so much as just something that causes you pain. And I don't really think you should be embarrassed by a vulnerability more than you should just be worried someone's going to use it against you. I don't know. Um... My dad was abusive to my mom, and she left him when I was two, so, I mean, I don't remember him abusing her, but I know how much it hurt her, and how much he tried to, like, draw me towards her because of it, and now she doesn't, like, want me to talk to him, and it's reflected a lot in his actions, because I visit my dad, but what am I gonna say, like, you hit my mom, you were abusive, what do you do, because it's wrong, but it's easier to find that fault, like, if I saw a dad abusing their child or their wife or something, I'd be like, hey, back the fuck off, who do you, what are you doing? But knowing that my dad did it, I can't not love him for it. I don't know. Maybe it's just because he hasn't abused me, and if he did, like, what would you do? Because it's your parents, but... I don't know. That's harsh. And, um... Oh, I, I lost my train of thought. I don't know. I think that if Chris Brown heard her, then his fans need to shut the fuck up because... Really, where did they get off having anything to say if that actually happened? You're idolizing someone that's done wrong. That's different than, like I was saying, like if your family member or something has done that, it's harder for you to dislike them for it. But some movie star that's... Oh, not movie star, sorry. Um, singer. That's... You can't condone that. You just... <laughs> what the hell? Um, that actually pisses me off if someone said that she deserved it. They deserved to be punched in the face. And I would do it personally if I could or if I punch people in the face. But I don't, so... And I can't. So, I don't know. Shane, if you would like to go to their house and kick their ass and put it on a YouTube video, you will be even more famous than you are now. What can I say? That's how the world works. Um... I think anyone that's abused or knows someone that abused, they could use some comfort. And I don't think it's something you should be embarrassed for. I think that if you have a really good friend or family, that's great and you should talk to them. Because there's no reason, like, as much as you want to be strong, you have to... Well, you don't have to, but I mean, it helps if you can just find that one person and you talk to them about it and see what they think and get an opinion. And beating people is wrong. And, um, yeah. So, you know, if anyone needs to talk, or whatever, magic spires. Yeah. Sorry for all of you that are hurt, though. Like, I really am sorry for all of you, and I hope that you can all get better from that. And I'm sorry that you, Shane, had to deal with that, because... Well, I mean, I don't know you, but you seem like a good person. You're funny. I don't know. That doesn't mean much, but... Yeah. I'm sorry that you were hurt. I'm sorry that anyone was hurt. There's not much I can do about it, but I would try to stop it if I could. At the risk of getting a lawsuit. I don't know. Night, y'all.